Hey, Suggers, it's your girl, Risa, coming to you today with a prep video, y'all. What's going on, everybody? Hey, how you doing? You feeling all right? Yeah. Well, I hope you feel better. And for those that are in good spirits, oh, tell the Lord thank you, okay? Mm-hmm. So, I am going to prep some salads, you guys. Um, I have some spinach here. I have some broccoli, some carrots, and I have some lettuce, okay? So, and I have some bacon crumbles. Cucumber. Don't know if I said cucumber. So, I'm going to try to do as many as I can. I have some little small jars, and it's just for the individual person. Because I want to be able to eat some. And I know if it's already prepared, then I'll eat it. You know, instead of me having to go in and peel and chop and do this, that, and the third. Okay. All right. So, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to get started. I'm not going to do any tomatoes in it because we have whole tomatoes and we don't want it juicy. You know. So, whenever they get ready to add tomatoes to their salad, then they can do that. All right. Salad dressing. I'm going to mix up some salad dressing that we can actually add on it. And we have some already store-bought salad dressing. So we're just gonna see how this work out. I also have some pickle jars that I'm gonna do. Don't know if I'm gonna do that in this video, but uh, maybe y'all will see that down the line, okay? All right, so what I need to do first is get this lettuce chopped up. So we're gonna do romaine lettuce. I don't do any iceberg lettuce anymore because you girl be burping, belching like an old <laughs> somebody. Okay, it, it just don't do me right. Okay, it don't do me right. No, it don't. We're going to get it all chopped up. And I'm going to get it rinsed. And laid out. I don't always chop my lettuce with a knife but because I'm putting this in jars I'm gonna do that sometimes I just break it with my hand and we keep it moving let me take more than one of these out here okay y'all G just reminded me about my kale um I kale that we got from Sprouts he already cooked that so I had to grab some <laughs> yeah listen we having to wing this thing. And you have to look at these leaves and see what's going on because some of them look a little decrepit. And they feel a little dirty. So we know this got to be washed. And we'll drain it. Okay. Anybody out there prepping salads or anything else this week? And this is good for us because, I mean, it's good year round, but baby, when you don't feel like cooking, and I'm gonna prepare, I'm not quite sure. I know it won't be today, probably tomorrow. Um, some chicken breast. I get G to put them on the grill for me. Some chicken breast. I wanna marinate them. So we have that. We have our spinach. Let's get some of this kale chopped up. Well, the kale is already chopped. So let me go ahead and chop some of this spinach up. We want to rinse this in cold water. Run some water on it. Okay, my chopped stems and all. I have two big packs of spinach. I don't think I'm gonna be able to make that many salad jars with what I have, but I'm gonna see. I have some jars that already have like pineapples in them. So I wanna do grapes and my strawberries and I have a few apples 
that I want to do. I want to mix them together, but I don't want to mix ones that's going to ooze, you know. And I try to get jars that, you know, will seal out or seal in, seal it up so it won't get any air to it. So I got some cannon jars, child. So we're going to see how that works. We're going to see how it works. Okay. All right. Now let's get this cucumber. Put. I split mine down the middle. And again, because we need these to fit in these jars. We don't want them big. And these are, I guess, seedless cucumbers. this up in here like that I'll put these cucumbers in here because I still have to rinse that mm, that's so good and fresh mm, I have another one over here What are some things y'all add? Now, I know after the fact, I like to add raisins. I like to add um, bacon, sunflower seeds, all of that. I have to see if I have any more sunflower seeds. You know, that's what I'm gonna have to see. I have some flax seed that I'm gonna add to my Salad dressing. And as far as like meat, I want to do some chicken breast. I want to add some, um, maybe some shrimp. I don't think I have any turkey, but we'll see. I don't know how long this is going to last me. And I think I might have six, maybe eight jars. So that's what we're going to start with. And the rest, if I have some containers, I might be able to do some big ones. And we'll go from there. But I just even love cucumbers by themselves, y'all. With a little apple cider vinegar and a little black pepper. <laughs> Who don't love a little bit of black pepper? Okay, so we have that. I'm gonna pause and I'm gonna rinse my salad. I'll be back. Okay guys, so I have nine jars already rinsed out. Um, I'm gonna dry them off. I'll wash them in hot soapy water. I have some my bacon crumbles and I have my carrots, I've rinsed my carrots. I'm gonna chop up my broccoli. And we're gonna keep it moving. So I may not show me doing all of them, but then I might speed it up. We'll see. I have five big jars that have like this orange tab on it, like the sealant. And as y'all can see, I wet myself up at the sink. Y'all know. Messy people syndrome. <laughs> Your girl is not prissy at all, okay? No matter. Okay. All right. So we have that. We have our kale. I'm just gonna put some out here. Okay. 
It's already been chopped. We have some broccoli. I'm gonna just cut. I like stems and all. Whatever you like, that's what you use. I'm gonna cut it up. I think, cause this is getting real messy. So, we are gonna figure it out. Look at my hand, child. I don't know about y'all, but that creeps me out. All that stuff. I am, y'all gonna find out. Your girl is a mess. I, I am, I am. So let me go ahead. I have my spinach and my romaine lettuce. And I'm gonna stuff these jars as much as I can. My broccoli and my kale. Put a few carrots in here. Some cucumbers. And bacon. Okay. I have one. There we go. We're going to keep it moving. I'll start with this. Okay. Put some more of the broccoli. And sometimes I might just do broccoli and kale. You know what I mean? Just make it what you want it to be. Or just do broccoli, kale, and cucumber. Okay. Push it down. And there we go. Put a few carrots on top. We're going to keep this train rolling. Let's do broccoli, carrots. I didn't put bacon in the other one because I don't have to have bacon in all of them. Cucumber. That can be just a simple something. Cucumber. Kale. Ooh, child. Some lettuce. Some more broccoli. Few carrots. Not everybody like carrots in their salad. Um, but if they don't like it, everybody in here is able for those that eat them. Might not be cute, but it's gonna be good. All right, so we need a little more broccoli. I have been enjoying. I have been, child. Let me get my. Let me get it together. I have been enjoying the broccoli. Uh, just, I just want to eat more vegetables. I do. And I know with me, some days I don't feel like doing anything. Anybody else be like that, Jill? You just be like, bump it. I'll just eat a sandwich. I, I want to get out of that. So if I can prepare this ahead of time, I could just grab it and squeeze some salad dressing on it and keep it moving. Okay. Do it like that. So this one, I'm going to put the lettuce in here. Cucumber. Okay. Carrots. This one I'm gonna do just romaine and spinach. 
all the way to the top. Okay, so with what I have left, which is this amount, I'm gonna just make Gia salad. Give him a few cucumbers, he don't like a whole lot. Put a little bit of kale on here. Like a lot of carrots, so I put about four or five. I sprinkle some broccoli on there. I mean broccoli, bacon crumbles, and then I'll be back to add the tomatoes. Now, when I get ready to eat my salad, I make sure I have me some boiled eggs. I like to add boiled eggs to it. Grate it up on my cheese grater. Ooh. We have our tomato. Put a little black pepper on his salad. I put some in this one. The ones that have bacon and mm, the ones, yeah, that have cucumber, I put a little black pepper in there. That's gonna be good. Okay. Here's his salad. We're gonna put his salad dressing on it and let that be there. Okay. All right. So jar number one. And they have this little slot on the top where you can write the date, or you just write it on there if you don't have it. Okay. There we have it. I got one more to tighten up. I see. If I get them all wiped off. And there we have it, y'all. We're going to start out. Now, I don't know how many days this is going to take us, but it's a start. So I can't, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get any more in the refrigerator. But I do want to transition from the metal tops to the plastic ones. And um, we're going to go from there get my marker and I'm going to write today's date on it and that's it I know that's an odd number but yeah happy eating y'all let me know what y'all doing that's game of salad I know my lighting is off y'all but it's storming outside and it's pitch black so it's a little different in here thank y'all for watching I'm late, but I'm here, y'all. Bye, sugar.